What's up everybody? Man Cave Dave here in Wisconsin with a real quick video game pickups video. This one's going to be a little bit different than my uh, usual. Because here I have some uh, Xbox 360 Collector's Edition games that I picked up today. Um, went to a, a game store that I don't usually go to and they had all of these on clearance. And so, um, you know, sometimes I try to think about what games today might be the collectible, collectible ones of tomorrow. And, uh, you know, there's some people love these, some people hate them, but the price was right, so I decided to go ahead and pick them up and just wanted to show them off and see what you think. So first off, we have Duke Nukem Forever Balls of Steel Edition. Uh, this was, the price tag on it was originally $99.99. It includes the bust of Duke Nukem, a 100-page hardcover book, postcards, radioactive emblem sticker, um, a comic book, a foldable paper craft, poker chips, mini card deck, re radioactive emblem dice, and a limited edition numbered certificate of authenticity. Uh, originally, the price tag was $99.99. Uh, it was on clearance for $19.99, so I went ahead and picked it up. I figured 20 bucks. might as well give it a shot. You can see, you know, the plastic isn't perfect. There's some stretch marks. Um, in it, but the box is in good shape, so I figured, again, I would go ahead and grab it. Uh, next, we have Batman Arkham City Collector's Edition. Um, again, you know, there's some scratches in the plastic. It's not perfect, uh, but it is sealed, and the box is in good shape. Um, this was originally, I think the sticker on it said $89.99. Uh, this one was 59 so a little bit more expensive, but I went ahead and picked it up. I've always liked Batman, and so if nothing else, um, this one will look cool sitting up on top of my shelf. Um, next, Ninja Gaiden 3, Collector's Edition. And let's see here. I'll show you what's in it. I guess it doesn't really show there. Hmm. Hmm. I guess I can't show you what's in it. Anyway, um, oh, yeah, here we go. So we've got the game, uh, the soundtrack, an art book, a cool Duel of the Mast figure, um, Dead or Alive 5 Alpha promo, demo, premium edition, downloadable code voucher, whatever. Um, this one was originally, um, oh, what was it, $99.99, uh, and it was on sale for $39, so... I went ahead and picked it up as well. You can probably hear my cat meowing in the background. I think he's hungry, ready for some dinner. Um, last but not least, we have Gears of War 3 Epic Edition. And this, um, this box is just huge. I mean, here is a Nintendo game <laughs> compared to this box. Uh, and so this was originally, I think it was $164.99, and I got it for... Um, Oh, what was it? Sixty-four ninety-nine, and so um, definitely thought that that was a pretty good deal. And uh, you know, it's got all kinds of cool stuff in it. it has some cool paperwork. Has a cool statue. Um, this is a game series that I've always wanted to get into, uh, but haven't yet. And so, um, not that I'll open this one, but uh, figured I would give it a shot. So anyway, sorry, some awesome camera work there. I know. All in all, I've got all four of these that I picked up for much, much less than, you know, what they would have been retail. Um, I'm not sure how I feel about the collector's editions. Again, figured I'd give them a shot, um, see what, uh, you know, see if they go anywhere with value. Um, and it's just kind of a cool thing to, to collect. But we'd love to hear your thoughts on collector's editions. If you have any favorites, any ones that... Um, you know, I should be looking for in the future. I saw they have that uh, Aliens, what was it, Colonial Marines. Um, I really liked the Aliens vs. Predator video games. I remember playing the, the first one on PC when it came out, and uh, AVP2. So that might be one that I look, on pick, look at picking up eventually. But uh, anyway, from here in Wisconsin, this is Man Cave Dave. Hope you enjoyed, and uh, I'll see you all at the next sale, whether it's a yard sale or a video game store sale. Take care.